Hi, my name is Becky Albertalli. I'm the author of Simon vs. the Homo Sapiens Agenda, and here are some fun and embarrassing facts about me. As I'm filming this, I am a couple of hours away from seeing Hamilton for the first time, and um, I am obsessed with Hamilton. All I do is listen to Hamilton. There was an audition flyer posted in the um, theater wing of Wesleyan, and it was for Lin Manuel Miranda's senior thesis play. He was a senior at Wesleyan University when I was a freshman. The flyer uh, mentioned they were specifically looking for people who had special talents and abilities, like rapping, um, that did not deter me for some reason. Um, so I proceeded to have just the most horrible, mortifying, like humiliating audition for Lynn manuel Miranda. Um, I think he was already kind of a big deal, I just didn't realize it, now he's a huge deal. So when I was in 8th grade, we used to have like this period of time every day um, that was set aside for silent reading. My best friend and I, we were really into this book, The Borrowers, <laughs> um, and actually the whole series of The Borrowers, um, but we did not just read The Borrowers, we um, read it looking for like euphemisms and made this book very sexual. <laughs> so. I am actually really good at claw machines. I have been obsessed with claw machines for a very long time. As a kid, I used to like legitimately have fantasies where and, and dreams. Like I would actually dream about this at night, um, where I was playing like the biggest claw machine with the biggest stuffed animals and winning one after another. Um, that was all I really wanted out of life. Like I think that was what I wanted to do when I grew up. I kept um, just a series of really embarrassing journals beginning from, I think there were a few in elementary school, uh, but mostly beginning in middle school and all the way up through college and a little bit after as well. Um, in high school, the journals got really honest. And that's where things got even more embarrassing. Some of what was in the journals actually made it into Simon, and I will not even share which parts made it into Simon directly from my journal. One thing I get a lot of questions about from readers of Simon is the Spear family Facebook scavenger hunt, which is a tradition in Simon's family where uh, they actually go on Facebook and have a scavenger hunt looking for um, different things among their Facebook friend list. That is something I made up, but it is very closely based on a Goldstein family tradition, Goldstein being my maiden name, uh, something my sister and I invented, which was the uh, Facebook bingo. So most people who know me know that I am a really embarrassing person. And one of my um, most memorable moments in that vein was actually at the launch party for one of my good friends. You know how sometimes your tights will kind of like slip down a little bit, kind of half to the halfway over your butt kind of point? Mine slipped down to my knees. Like, if you're trying to pull your tights up from your knees, you can't do that like in front of people. Like You can't do that in the middle of the room because you have to actually lift up your skirt. I, um, now I know, here's how you fix it. Um, this is like ultimate proof that I'm a really embarrassing person because I'm saying this on camera. You put your Spanx over your tights. This is soap for awkward moments. Like that's actually what it is and what it says. This was given to me last night by my editor, <laughs> who, Donna Bray, who knows me um, well enough to know that um, like, this is just my perfect soap. I think I've proven that today. <laughs>